President Xi Jinping is a, is a strong leader who, who has a clear vision of where he wants to uh, lead China, and in particular uh, a vision of China's uh, role in, in the world. Well, I think uh, President Xi has proved himself to be a highly effective uh, leader and one who has a very clear vision and a very clear sense of where he would like China to go, and also a pretty good understanding of the uh, political and other mechanisms that he needs to use in order to achieve that vision. Um, so I think he's uh, definitely proved himself to be a very impressive uh, and skilled leader. Without leadership, such a, such a strong, firm leadership and visionary leadership, none of these things can be realized. So this is very important. He has not only gained the trust of his own people, but also really turned the uh, a tide of opinion uh, regarding many different things. I admire uh, President Xi Jinping's recognition of the importance of changing the economic model of China from a high-speed, extensive model of development uh, to a what is termed new normal, uh, but especially an, an intensive model of development that depends more on quality and innovation and efficiency. Uh, rather than on increasing the number of workers and increasing the number of inputs into production. Uh, I think that's a very important transition if China is going to become a high-income uh, country with a high-quality economy over time. We know from experience elsewhere there are many countries that have reached this point in their development. Relatively few have become high-income countries. So this is a very complicated difficult, uh, wide-ranging set of changes that are needed. And I frankly have admired the scope of the reform effort, as we see in the third plenum resolution, in the fourth plenum resolution, and in many of the other decisions that have been made uh, since then. Uh, but it is going to take a long time, and we will have to see in terms of concrete implementation uh, how effectively it goes. But I think uh, both China and everyone else has, a, has an interest in China's managing this relatively successfully. And I would say it's uh, unprecedented in China's modern history. So therefore this should be fixed. And uh, so Xi Jinping took a very aggressive approach. So uplift the public confidence. China's uh, uh, relationship with South Korea couldn't be better. China certainly played the Russia car very well. And um, China's European relations differ from China-US relations in some important way. The most recent development with the AIIB. You can see that uh, 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 some of the Western countries certainly signed up to uh, AIIB. Uh, which foreign observers think that uh, it's uh, really an uh, embarrassment for U.S. government to try to you know, resist that change. So in all these areas, three in domestic front, one in international front, he has achieved you know, significantly.